guys, I'm back for another video and today I'll be sharing with you this golden purpley kind of silver um, eye tutorial. I don't really know what to call it, but I just think it's absolutely pr like super pretty, dramatic, perfect for a night out. Um, you can skip the step with the um, pigments and then it looks more wearable, but I absolutely love the way it came out. We're using some fake eyelashes, some dark browns and purples, some silvers, and I just really like it. Um, if you guys wanna see how I did this look, then keep on watching. Okay, so I started off by priming my eye with my Too Faced Shadow Insurance in Candlelight. And this one is not clear, it's shimmery. I don't know if you guys can tell, it's a little shimmery. Um, and I'm using this one because I'm using mainly shimmery colors like maybe two matte colors, and that's basically it. I'm using my Marc Jacobs palette, and I'll be taking this silver shade and applying that into the first half of my eyelid. For the second part of my eyelid, I'll be using this shade which is um, kind of like a rose gold color. And I'll be using that for the second part of my eyelid. Now I'm taking my purple from my Dior palette, a Sonia Kashuk brush, and I'm just putting this color into my crease. Now I'm taking this dark purple color um, from my BH Cosmetics palette and I'm putting that in my crease as well. Focusing more towards the outer V. And I'm just applying that into kind of my outer V area. We're basically just going to be blending a bunch of dark colors into the outer V. As a transition color, I will be using Soft Brown from MAC, using a blending brush from Sephora, and I'm just going to blend that out right above the crease. Now I'm taking a more defined crease brush, and I am using this color called Cholita from my Kat Von D palette, and I'm putting that into the crease as well and into the outer V. This color is really dark, so a little goes a long way. Don't use too much. Okay, and I'm going back with my blending brush and I'm just blending everything out. The next color I'm using is from the Dior palette again, and it's the black shimmery shade. And I'm just using that in the crease as well, but I'm using a smudge brush because I don't want to have the color like all over the place. I want it to be like super concentrated in one area. So we're just going to make a little V. I'm going to draw a little V. Just like that and just bullet. To take this color from Alme, this light one, and I'm going to use that as a highlight. Okay, now for the fun part, I will be taking my pigment from Mika Beauty Cosmetics, and I don't know, this one is in Carnival number no. 9. And it's just like a really nice golden coppery shade. And I'm going to be taking it on this e.l.f. applicator. This is called the Glitter, gl Glitter Eyeshadow Applicator. And it's basically like a silicone brush. I'm going to pack a little bit onto the applicator. And it just grabs onto the color really nicely, um, which is why I like this product. And you're just going to lightly tap it onto your eyelid. We're going to apply some fake lashes. Um, I'm using Demi Wispies by 
Cardell and look like this, just wispy lashes. So I'll be using that with some lash glue and my tweezers. Okay, now that I have my lashes on, they look like that. I don't know if you guys can tell, but they just basically make your outer lashes look nice and full and pretty. So the next step is while the glue is drying, I don't want to put mascara on. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to work on the lower lash line. So I will be taking this shade from my Sephora palette, um, this one right here. And it's kind of like a dark maroon from the Sephora palette, this one right here. It's like a shimmery white, and I'm putting this into my inner corner to brighten it up. Now I'm taking my Urban Decay Eyeliner in Rockstar, and I'm not using a black because the eye look mainly is purple, so I'm using this color, and it's not a black. It's kind of like a brown, like dark brown, Now I'm going to curl my eyelashes so that my natural eyelashes blend in with my real lashes. So that the natural lashes blend in with the fake lashes. And you want to be very careful when you're doing this so that you don't like pull the fake eyelashes off during this process. Okay, and now we're going to apply mascara. So the first mascara I'm using is their Real by Benefit, which is, you guys know, my all-time favorite. And this is the Hypno Star Mascara. And you can see that the wand is really interesting because it's like triangular shaped and then when you flip it, it's flat. So it gives you really dramatic lashes. So if you are the type that likes dramatic lashes, then this mascara is amazing. I seriously recommend it. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and this is the finished product. I can zoom you guys in and show you it more in depth. So we have some golds and purples and silvers, and it just came out really pretty. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and if you did, then please don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe, and I will see you guys later. Bye!